Hi others, uh, haven't been around for two weeks because of Lunar New Year, Happy New Year. And also I was, I was spending some time with family and be present and be part of my grandma's 100 year milestone. Um, the way she calculated her, her age this year should be 100th year of her presence on the mother earth so happy birthday um not much has been done for the past two weeks um but uh, i do have some you know i i enjoy watching mind opening or like videos that makes me think and kind of come up with some reflections that I would like to share and hopefully, not hopefully, probably you'll relate to as well. Um, so, you know, we, we look within and find our true self and stay sincere and authentic to that true self. Yet, identify the patterns that you most often fall into and think of how to break the patterns. Otherwise, um, staying true to yourself can be destructive to others and, of course, to yourself and can most often be used as an excuse for your behaviors and of which you think you have no responsibility for whatsoever. Um, yeah, so probably the idea is, is not just to, you know, be yourself, but then to recognize those patterns um, Recognize those patterns that you often fall into, uh, try to alter these patterns, break these patterns, and try to form different patterns so that you can live a better life. Uh, I know that one of the patterns I want to break is that when I, when I got a bit like unbelievable of some of the things that probably some people say or you know, just not really getting the point. I tend to, like many, um, when I get into an, into an argument, I probably get into, raise up my voice too much. Not too much. I mean, I raise my voice a little bit and probably my tone is like in disbelief as in how come certain people will do certain stuff. Um, but yeah, that's something I... I recognize and I would like to break and um, also I mean I've been in the UK for four years I feel like I'm getting more I'm, I'm, I'm more used to being alone now uh, probably post trauma of the COVID lockdown situation <laughs> um, and uh, living alone not really getting um, had much of a you know tell me telling me to do that and that and having someone to uh, to talk me into doing things um, I need to be more and more and I'm trying to get more back to familiarizing myself when I'm around family um, although I do tread like precious my private time and we're alone time um, but yeah, that's something about role switching as well, um, as in, you know, we, we often caught into conflicts, which may be due to uh, the roles that we have. We all have multiple roles in this society nowadays. Uh, I can be, you know, an entrepreneur, but at the same time, I, I'm still my mom's son or I'm still, you know, or someone's friend. Um, I need to be aware of the role that I'm currently into for me to behave associated, uh, to, to me, for me to behave accordingly. And that may solve a lot of issue and for better relationships. But anyways, um, so for the past few weeks, um, I happened to kind of reach out to er, to a illustrator. So um, the, the visual that you see now is actually my mascot. Uh, so it's an it's an author. Hopefully you feel that it's he's very welcoming and very chill. 
uh, feel free to leave your thoughts uh, or let me know your thoughts if you think probably yeah just let me know your thoughts and if there's anything that you feel like probably can be amended let me know I, I would love to know um, and also even though I haven't really opened up my computer for the past two weeks I've been it, it's kind of hard to escape those thoughts as in how things should work nowadays so I, I was kind of deciding to I decided to remove some of the restrictions that I had planned in my mind for the app but recognizing that I'm probably creating a bit too much uh, restriction or hurdle for the user well I can do it in another fashion to make it more user friendly so probably instead I'll just upfront uh, lay out a story to build up the behavior or build build up a new universe that I would like to create people in for people to enjoy in my app so that's the other thing um, and the also to try focus more on working out a complete version and probably have some of the features uh, built as an add-on later on uh, of which can be even after it's launched uh, to the app stores reason being that I feel like there has been a bit back and forth well um, things are still heading towards completion it's just recognizing that actually I don't necessarily uh, this yeah it's kind of like the just there's, there's a concept called MVP I think it is, it is. Um, so that's probably something that I'm gonna focus on as well um, but yeah that's pretty much it and thank you for listening and I will see you guys next week